Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Ishmael from Conjured Realm. Okay, so in today's video, I wanted to talk to you guys about whether or not you should be giving up on your manifestation. The short answer, personally, would be no. Do not give up. Don't give up on your manifestation, okay? I know a lot of people want to give up on manifestation because they're affirming for a few days or a couple weeks or however long and they're getting discouraged and they're doubting but see that's that's your ego talking the ego is trying to keep you safe and keeping you in that old state of mind that you once had because it feels like you're safer there and we know that the ego does not help us when manifesting so you need to persist okay you need to persist until it hardens into fact until it materializes into your 3d don't give up when things get hard you know you need to persist because eventually these assumptions that we're creating within our minds will become a stern fact and the fun part about it is you don't even have to believe your affirmations that's the best thing about affirmation or law of assumption that i learned that was it was like almost life-changing because that's how powerful we are we can say a few words and have sprinkles of that thing start to happen in our 3d reality without having to fully believe in it yet okay so also i wanted to say as good as i am now with manifesting it took time for me to get here it took time for me to solidify myself in the beliefs that i have now it took time for me to unlearn a lot of things i grew up with this is a process it's a journey you have to you have to stick it out, right? Because you need to weigh out your options. Do you want to go back to the you that is never chosen, is always broke, never gets what they want in life? Or would you rather just take on this new journey of manifestation, work through these things? Because once you work, let's say you have like a money block. Once you work through this money block, like that's it. You never have to work on it again. And money is just going to continuously just always be there for you. This, this is something you work on and you never have to fix ever again. But if you give up, then you'll never fix it. And you'll just continuously see yourself going back to where you didn't want to be. And that's what brought you here in the first place. So I don't recommend you give up. Continue to say your affirmations. Believe that it's going to happen. Because the thoughts that you have now, the seeds that you plant today are going to be manifested in the future a lot of the times you can say affirmations and you can say your intentions and have them happen quickly but like i said the more resistance you have towards something deciphers whether or not you get that quickly or slowly but that's okay it doesn't matter forget about time what should matter to you now is that eventually you'll have what you want right it, Right now, don't even think about timing. I think the biggest stressor in manifestation right now with people that are just coming into this is they're so caught up in when it's gonna happen, when it's gonna happen. To be honest with you, um, I can't tell you when it's gonna happen. I truly can't because I don't know how long it's gonna take for you to start to assume it to the point where it starts to show up in your 3D. You know, we all grow up with different beliefs. We all grow up with different assumptions about life about like just everything in general so my the time that it took me may not be the same time it takes you I also i can't i don't know how long people may be affirming for i don't know how long people are spiraling and then getting back on track like all that you need to take all that into consideration when it comes to when something will happen but i will tell you this for sure if you never change your thoughts then you'll never get the the new manifestation that you've been waiting for so think about it like this the time is gonna pass regardless would you rather not get your thing at all or would you rather work on it and eventually get it to me i rather eventually get it the timing really isn't that big of a deal to me obviously if i have things on the time crunch there are ways you can go about it to make it happen faster but Nine times out of 10, we're not doing things on time crunches. We're just manifesting just for a better lifestyle. So I do recommend that you don't give up. Just continue to use your affirmations, 
continue to just focus on you. I know it's also very common for someone to look at someone else's results and they start to feel like they can't do it, it's not working for them, I'm telling you. You are so powerful that by you deciding that it's not working for you, you're using manifestation. The universe or whatever is giving you this power is like, okay, got it. They don't want this to work for them. And that's, that's a manifestation. So you're doing it so well that it's working. So now let's try to bring it back a little bit and intentionally use this power that we have to focus on things that we want to change, that we want. So, so yeah, don't give up. I know that it's a process, it's something new. There is a learning curve because we've we've gotten so much BS from law of attraction, all the bullshit about love and frequency and vibration that some of us are coming from there, some of us are new. So all this is gonna be a little bit to get acclimated with, but just keep going, just keep going. Even as good as I am now in manifesting, there are times where I will be affirming for something that I really, really want or I need something to happen or something to shift. And you know, the 3D will not show me any movement. I won't get movement. There will be no movement whatsoever. Only for my manifestation to happen all at once. So I tell you that to say that even if the 3D doesn't give you any signs or movement that it's working, it's still working. The 3D may not always show you that it's working, but there's always movement that you may not be seeing. So I hope that that was encouraging for you and you can keep that in the back of your mind whenever you're manifesting and you don't see huge movement. All right, guys, I hope that video was useful to you. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe and hit the bell notification down below so you're notified every time I post a new video. All right, guys, happy manifesting.